Hi! This tutorial contains information on how to work with Gtelemus Cherry Services module, which allows adding services to the pages built with Elementor Leaf Page Builder. First, let's navigate to WordPress dashboard and make sure that both Cherry Services List, Gtelemus Addon and Elementor Leaf Page Builder are installed and active on your site. To do it, open Plugins Install Plugins tab. Here you can view the list of all plugins installed on your site. Ok, it's time to go to Services tab on the left of the dashboard. If you haven't created any services yet, you'll need to create them before displaying them with Cherry Services Gtelemus module. Note the Cherry Services module is a dynamic one. This means that it embeds the existing content only, so before using it, first you'll need to create the content to display. First, let's create some categories to which we will assign the services. Navigate to Categories tab and here input the new category name, slug and click Add new category button. We'll create several of them in order to group some of the services. Just repeat the actions to get more of the categories. Ok, now navigate to Add New to add a new service. Here I need to type in the new service name and indicate the categories where I want to assign this service. Then I scroll the page down and locate the Service Options block. Here I need to choose the service icon and I input the service description in the corresponding field. After that let's set the featured image for this service. I select one from the media library. Now everything is ready, so I can click Publish button. Now let's return to Services tab to view the list of services. To create more of them quickly, you can hover on one of the services and click Clone option. Then you'll be able to change the information you want to differ and leave the information which you want to be singular for several services. Then click Publish. You can repeat these actions until you have all the services you want to display on the page built with Elementor. Now that we have lots of services to display, we can navigate to Pages or Pages tab. Here select the page where you want to add the services list and click Edit with Elementor option. I want to add the services to the end of my page, so I scroll it down, then I drop the Cherry Services widget to the section where I want it to show. Now you can see the services on your website's page. Pay attention to the left, there is Cherry Services Content block. Here you can type in the titles for your services in the corresponding fields. As you can see, you can change the number of columns in which services will be shown for different devices. And you can also change the number of posts per page. In Show Services Form Categories drop-down, you can select the exact services category which will be shown in this block. The rest of the services stay hidden, but you can click More button to view them. You can also disable Read More button and use Pagination instead. As you can see, everything works properly. Another curious option allows to display the category filter before services list. Enable this option to see the results. I also want to change the whole section Paddings, so I click Edit Section option and here open Advanced Settings. Here I input my custom padding values in the corresponding fields. Ok, let's save the results. We navigate to the page and scroll it down to see how the services are displayed now on the page. This is the end of our tutorial. Thanks for watching!